It's time for Wonderful, Wonderful Adventure, Adventure Now Korea. Korea, the tricky edition. So what we're doing today, we're going to the Trick Eye Museum. We've seen this a lot in Korean dramas and we work right beside the Trick Eye Museum. I just have to interrupt you for a second. What? Okay. Hey, we saw this in all these dramas. What are some of the dramas they were in, Simon? Uh, they've seen it in um, Twinkling Twilight Over the Stars of... Uh-huh. And definitely one about Korean history. And what's the other one called? Um, Heartstrings. Yeah. Heartstrings! <laughs> and also, the Girls They Hug Me Once video did a video there. So Is it called Hug Me Once or just Hug Me? I think it's called Hug Me Once. Only once? That seems really yeah. cold. Here, then... done, go, alright. So we're gonna go there, we're gonna show you what it's like, and hopefully we're gonna have lots of fun optical erosion. Yeah, so we're gonna try to show you guys a rough idea of how to get here. So we're gonna turn the camera around for a second here. Okay. Oh my god, I almost forgot! <laughs> so that main intersection you see down there, Hongdae Station, you want to exit exit number 9 and when you walk out of the station, you're just literally going to walk straight. You're just going to walk straight and you're going to turn left onto this street. So right there at the corner, you're coming up this way. You're going to follow that scooter. You know that you're on the right path if you see the only Taco Bell in all of Hongdae. Okay, so if you see the Taco Bell, you're heading the right direction. I don't think Taco Bell will ever close down, right here? Doubt it. No, because if I give you any other landmark, it's gonna close down over time. What? You're gonna be hanging a right on the street where you see a holika holika. Okay, don't be distracted by Jin Battery. Series. And here we are, the Trick Eye Museum. It's a lot smaller than I expected it to be. That's it. It's pretty small. Oh, wait. Oh. You gotta actually go in there. My bad, it's actually a museum over here. Here we are. Very colorful looking. I thought it was like just a trick eye museum, but it seems to be like a bunch of museums mashed into one. We gotta we gotta go to the ticket box first, and then we have like a whole bunch of things to see. Ooh, ancient Athenum costume play. I'm gonna be a big Greek goddess and I wanna have big feathers. Let's go. What are you doing? Why are you staring at me, huh? What's your friggin' problem? Do me come out of this picture frame. You do it! Tell him to stop staring at me. Oh uh, uh, yeah. Is this how girls poo? Uh, Maybe your other hand should be on your cell phone so you can text message people like multitasking. Oh my god. Uh, no, seriously, girls, Albert. I have to know what takes you so long in the washroom. Every time I go to the washroom, I sit in line, I wait like a million years for the next five girls to come out, then I go in and I come out and I'm finished. But everyone else seems to take like forever. I think they're secretly curling one out or playing video games. Yes, Sai. I would like that strawberry daiquiri with pineapple on the side. What are you having, Simon? Is this supposed to be like this? Um, I think so. I'm not sure. I'm not that little. Okay, this is actually cramping my back. Okay, wow. get down. Get down. Na 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 na. The power of BAP is growing me. The power of BAP is growing me. It's time for an episode of Simon Martinez Questionable Content Time. Today's questionable content is this one of a dude whose pants are coming out, which looks like there might have been a little bit of a penis showing and suddenly this penis was blurred out by something. Or am I supposed to grab this and take a picture down his pants? Either way, questionable content. Okay, so we actually do have instructions for giant awkward erection. You're supposed to be pinching his underwear and being surprised. Oh, shh, peek it out. What's inside the pants? Don't be shy, take a peek, hee hee. It's a penis. <laughs> It's a penis. Oh my god. Ah, what are you doing? You can't do this. You're supposed to look up her skirt. Are we allowed to ride on him? Or does it say do not ride on him? When I look at this picture, I do not see do not ride on him. What does that look like? Please do not suck his butthole. Yes, don't <laughs> suck his butthole. Don't suck his butthole. The twinkle, twinkle, lochana. You got something like this? How's the rest isn't of the there, dance go? There that this? was such an unmemorable dance. <gasps> um. <laughs> this isn't made for big people. Warning, Trick Eye Museum is only made for people underneath six foot. Okay. Save me! I'm here! I'm making a dance! Honk, honk. 
in my time of need, you fall into my crotch. Is that the kind of person you are? Ow! Save me! Why am I picking your nose? Oh my god. Oh my god, I know I'm on a diet and I shouldn't, but a little snack should be okay, right? Oh. Hey girl, can I buy you a drink? Oh my god. I'm gonna roll my window back up. And then she said to me, I don't even like Super Junior. And I was like, Oh my God, who doesn't even like Super Junior? Can you even believe that? I know, I can read from your face that you're just like totally repulsed like I am. Hey, remember how in our last Music Monday we wound up saying that the guy shouldn't run in the mirror room because he could get hurt? He thought we were lying? We are entering the magic mirror room right now and it says do not run. Why? Because you could probably get hurt. See you later. Uh, Don't run time away from me. I will use my spider senses to get us through this maze, Simon. Hiya! Do you seriously know how good I am at these? It is ridiculous. Should I abandon you and let you find your own way through the mirror maze? No, because you're walking back now. Hmm. You're, you've technically turned 180 degrees. Why don't you try? Go, Simon, go. Okay, that's an actual corner. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I told you, you gave up! Ha! I got us out, Martina didn't! Meow, 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 I wanna meow, meow, meow. Was that the right word we were looking for? Cats? Cats Museum. Museum of Cats? And. There are no cats? No, no cats. Do, 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 do. I told you, Spongy, if you ate too much, you'd turn into a piggy! Ta da! Ta da! Do. When was the last time you watered these plants? They look totally like they're dry and dead. Pandas are like some of the most sleepy animals in the world. Dumbledore could totally kick my ass in a fight. This is in my washroom stall. That's pretty hilarious. Especially like... That detail right there. I'm not sure if awesome is how I would describe what was in your stall because when you describe it, like, that's funny, but now, like, no, it's a foreigner. Why, why can't you do this? <laughs> why can't you do a two-edged trick? I mean, so we already have a bad, <laughs> bad rap. name here in Korea. <laughs> So graceful. Okay, so I'm not sure how this angry bird is supposed to be a trick guy. You're just gonna, that's it? This is supposed to be a trick? This is the lamest trick ever. He's a visual, that's who you are, there you go. Is that what chitty, happens in the video? Chitty, chitty, chitty. Ace of angels or something, they've got angel wings. Boys are ace. Except they land and they're all like. Yes. Not great at acting, guys. Wait. That spear's coming at you. You Wait. could die. You could die any second Stop now. Stop rushing me! Oh no! Forget it. Shh. You're disturbing the other portraits. I'm sorry, other like portraits. No, guys, calm down. by fondling nipples. Uh, <sighs> so that's pretty much the Trick Eye Museum for yeah. you right there. I was expecting a lot more optical illusions with mm -hmm. like depth and whatnot, mm -hmm. but it turns out that these were just a lot of portraits painted on the wall that you have to hold your hand beside. But it's basically like a funny picture thing. Like you come here, you take uh, pictures, and you show your family these funny pictures. I don't know, I just feel like for $26 for two people, I would yeah. have expected something more because... It was something like $25 to get into Latte World. I'd definitely spend the extra 10 bucks and go on some huge amusement, amusement ride. park. That, amusement you know. Park but I'll tell you what else made me really disappointed. Can you see that right down here? These are dolls. These are little dolls. Uh -huh. Why don't I just show them the dolls? It's just like a little ceramic doll and you can like paint it with markers and stuff. So it's Ochanon, which is like basically five bucks for a doll. If I want to actually buy it with a debit card, it's eight dollars. So I'm basically spending an extra six bucks. Six I could have just dollars. bought an extra doll. It's a coffee shop and it's a doll factory and it's open till nine and it's only 7.30. Shouldn't this be 
open for me to use. I feel grumpy, I wanted to paint a doll. I think we should end our day by going to get some warm street food of some kind. Maybe like an ice cream cone. Let's do or that. perhaps a gelato. Only if it is a gelato. Let's go get a gelato. I will get a gelato. Okay. Simon promised me street breads. We're going for egg ball. That's the only thing that's gonna make us feel better yeah. after this. Original chocolate chip, dang kong peanuts. So that's it for this week's wonderful adventure now in Korea. We feel a little bit of redemption by getting these egg balls now. I've never had egg balls before, but... Neither have I. We just found this random place with a disco ball. We're like, let's like, buy some egg balls. Squat out of the way so people can see it. There it is. It was only $2. It was really delicious. I got the chuckle balls. How are your chuckle balls? Good. How are you? Oh. Oh. He took two. You saw him, which is a cheater. Leaving. Thank you.